totally incredible day. It has been dump trailer dilemma. Unbelievable. I got to tell you all this. It not so good. Okay. Started out great. Had a good breakfast. Got had a meal cooked for me. Crispy bacon. You know the kind of bacon I'm talking about. I mean, it's almost like so close to being burned, but it's not. And so when you put it in there and it's like beef jerky, you just want to keep chewing it and chewing it and chewing it. You know, get all that good salt out of there and everything like that. Thought, yeah, man, it's going to be a fantastic day. It's going to take off. Everything's going to be lovely, just lovely. However, it did not go like that always. So, we, uh, we ended up having to, yes, All right, had to drop that dump trailer. We're pulling off now. I'll get back to this. Okay, we're finally home. Unbelievable day. It just really was incredible. You know, I'm going to get to it. Some of the high points were all five trailers were on location. Tyson wants to make a cameo appearance. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hey, there's the buddy. There's the buddy dog. Hey, the buddy dog. Hey, the buddy dog. Hey, everybody, buddy. Yeah. Look at the camera there, Tyson. Oh, I want to see them snacks you got there. Yeah. Yeah. I know you got some snacks. So, it was just wild and incredible. And so I go over to one house get a trailer. They say, man, we're not quite done yet. Can you give us 10 minutes? Sure. Good customer. Had six, three trailers on location Saturday. So, uh, you know, they pay in the bills. So help them out. 20 minutes later, we're on the road trying to get to the dump. And the whole reason is I got no empty trailers. a great problem to have however if you're running multiple trailers you should always have one more than what you got on location so if you're running four trailers you really need to have five if you're running three trailers you really need to have four okay so you can always have one to swap out well I got all five on location one person had a crew that left and said, we'll be back on Thursday. And he's like, nah, that ain't working, man. We got to we gotta get these jobs done, get this money collected. People get pissed off. Somebody else come in behind you, swoop that job up and everything because they say, hey, we can get it done quick. So he understands how it works. He's making it happen. But I told the guy, I said, look, man, I got a trailer. It needs to go to somebody else. They prepaid. And he was like, I understand, man. Go ahead and pick that trailer up and everything. You know, what's left over, we'll put the wrappers in some big uh, contractor bags. And, uh, you know, we'll make do with what we can and everything. Unfortunately, can't always be a totally nice guy because sometimes you got to say, hey, I got to get that trailer. So, the thing about it is, is that I made a push, and I gambled, okay? I rented two trailers from two of my buddies talking to somebody else for a possible third trailer. Now, if that happens, I might as well just go ahead and buy another one. Why not? So... We're going to be looking. We'll just have to see what uh, what comes down and uh, drops in our lap, so to speak. So, it's been a good day. It's been a learning experience. We've had to do some serious shuffling. We got some great customers that we work with. Very blessed. Got Tyson, the real estate pit bull. He's right here by my feet because I got a little bit of food right here. And... Uh, I was like, hey, dude, I'd like some food. I like uh, scallops and rice, too. So, 
he likes everything but broccoli, <laughs> like his dad. So I hope you in YouTube land have a great day, and it's been profitable, it's been productive, and live long and prosper, my friends. Take care. I'm about to go with night-night.